As part of the Gfinity Elite Draft Showcase, and there's that wedding outfit by Akiman. I love that wedding outfit on Chun Li versus TDTJ's trademark Nakali pick. Let's go round one in this fourth game. Hope you're enjoying the night, folks. This is the fourth game. We're going to have one more game after this. But first, it's Renz versus TDTJ in round one. Team Aurora versus Team Inspiron. Okay, it's an early neutral air jump from TTTJ, and here comes that aggressive play from Renz already. He's already got TJ in the corner. TJ trying to go for a V-Skill, but gets stuffed out of it. And look at this anti here from Renz. He's already got TJ almost stunned, but there's that frame trap from TJ. All right, and a back throw from Renz. I like it. He's got TJ back in the corner again. There's that frame trap with the standing medium punch. TJ's in trouble. Renz not lining up with the pressure. Here comes the V-Trigger activation, and V reversal straight away by Renz, but unfortunately he gets rewarded with a corner position. Oh, and just goes for a reversal, but he's going to pay for that. And just like that, that EX reversal on Wake Up costing Renz a dearly. TJ taking round one by the skin of his teeth as we move into round two. Alright, and it looks like Renz starting off a little more pensively in round two. He was playing very aggressively in round one. He has to continue that pressure now if he wants to try and get TJ on tilt. Alright, that is safe. Alright, TJ baiting a crush counter with that standing roundhouse. Renz not biting. Alright, Ren's opting to dash forward. There's that anti-air and the 50-50 cross hunter. Very well blocked by TJ. Alright, there's the pressure from TJ now. He's got Ren's in the corner. Great dash under by Ren's. Alright, ooh, and a big risk from TJ. He's going to pay dearly for that. Here comes the big combo. And there's that new cancel into the V-Skill in Season 3.5. And he does it again. TJ is very stubborn tonight. He's not getting put off by that block from Ren's. Alright, here comes the V-Trigger activation from TJ. Oh, and a very bad EX legs from Renz85. He's going to pay for that. All right, and he's got Renz in the corner again. And there's that meaty pressure I was talking about. You cannot press buttons against this man. And a straight two rounds from TJ against Renz85. Putting the first game up very convincingly for Team Inspiron. Renz is going to have to make an adjustment here. I like the aggressive play. Just needs to be a little bit more careful with those reversal wake-up legs. Round one. All right, game two. TJ up one game for Team Aurora. Oh, and a big jump in from TJ. Renz is going to pay for that. He's almost in the corner. All right, putting out that crouching light short, trying to get out of the corner desperately. All right, big jump in from TJ. From Renz, TJ doesn't bite. All right, again, that's the third wake up. And Renz getting a little bit frustrated, answering with his own wake up. TJ sniffs it out. Renz, get, Renz pays dearly for that. All right, no buttons on wake up. Renz in big trouble. He's almost done. There's the second overhead from TJ. And no answer from Renz85 as TJ takes the third round in a row in Game 2. Round two. Renz is having a lot of trouble. He's been playing very aggressively, but TJ has just been able to do... He just knows when to do those wake-up DPs. He's got the Kazunoko factor. Renz getting a little bit frustrated, and there it is again. He's 4 for 4 on those reversal DPs. All right, great crush counter 3 from TJ. He's going to corpse carry Renz all the way to the corner, backing off now, trying to wait for Renz to do something. There's the jump. He did bait it out very well. All right, great anti here. Doesn't up to cross up anymore. Stays on the same side. Good damage. 50%. 76 seconds left on the clock. TJ backing off. Waiting for a jump from Renz. Great roundhouse from Renz. He's in trouble now. All right, TJ backing off. Both players even on life. Here comes the V-Trigger activation. Again, a V-reversal on that activation from Renz. Doesn't want to deal with any of the plus frames from TJ. All right, Renz dashing up. But TJ was ready for it. And again, and a miss with the EX legs, and that's the second time that has costed Renz the round. And TJ is up two games to zero. Renz needs to stop going to those EX legs on Wake Up. He is getting a little bit frustrated with that meaty pressure from TJ. That's the second time it's cost Renz the round. Very unfortunate drop there. It is, of course, a good counter. TJ does like to go to the meaty pressure, but unfortunately he's got Renz's number as to when he likes to go to that EX reversal. We're going to see a switch here. And no, Renz opting to stick with Chun, his main. I like it. Let's see if TJ Renz can get a round on the board. All right. Renz needs to get a game on the board for Team Inspiron. He's down 0-2 against TJ. All right. And TJ capturing the walk back from Renz to get out of the pressure. All right. And a great cancel into the disc. And again, there's that wake up EX. And he's dropped all three of those. That's going to cost him dearly. All right. And there's the crush counter. And it's the stun straight away. And TJ, so aware of Renz's... Renz is really uh, ability or his preference to go to buttons or EX reversals on wake up. He's been capitalizing so well on that. And it's been costing Renz so many rounds. Alright, great confirm into the EX legs. 
It's time for Renz to make something happen. This is his big chance. He has to get around on the board against TJ. Right, and there's the EX legs again, costing him more damage. All right, great catch on the Ford dash. It's time for Renz to activate. He needs to shine, but there's the V-Trigger activation already from TJ. Renz is in trouble. All right, he finally gets a reversal with EX legs on Wake Up. All right, Renz is in big trouble, and there's the activation from TJ. That could close it out, and that is going to be it. Six straight... Oh, that's six straight rounds from TJ for Team Aurora. And unfortunately, Renz goes down 0-3. Very unfortunate. Win. And Renz' propensity to press too many buttons on Wake Up, TJ really taking advantage of that. That is the name of the game in Street Fighter V. You have to be very careful with your options on Wake Up, and TJ sniffed it out so well. And that is a win on the game. 3-0 for Team Aurora. Very well played by Zed. I believe he also won last week as well, so that's two...